So just to wrap up sustainable development that we've done in the previous classes, let's talk about the 17 sustainable development goals put forth by United Nations in 2015. So basically this is to bring down poverty, to give good education, there should be zero hunger. In short, or in other words, you can think of everything that people, the haves, the haves have, and we, the haves take it for granted. This should be provided to everyone, the have-nots. And over and above, we should also talk about, we should worry about the environment. We should talk about life on the sea. We should talk about life on land. We should talk about peace. We should talk about integration. That's exactly what we're going to do. Have a quick look. So these are the 17 goals, sustainable development goals. And this is the 2030 agenda and it's 17 sustainable development goals adopted in 2015. They give a framework for addressing challenges. Uh, this was by the UNDP, uh, sorry, United Nations and the United Nations Secretary General Antonio Castres. So talking about these goals, the uh, 70th session of United Nations General Assembly held on 25th September 2015 adopted the document titled Transforming Our World, the 2030 Agenda for Sustainable Development, consisting of 17 Sustainable Development Goals, SDGs, and 169 associated targets. And the Sustainable Development Goals for 2030 evolved from the Millennium Development Goals for 2015. I think the, 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 they were eight of those by United Nations Development UNDP program. And this is a comprehensive, the SDGs, they are a comprehensive list of global goals and they all seek to address not only the root cause of poverty but also the universal need for development to provide a life of dignity to all. So obviously if you have all this, you will have a dignified living. So that's it. Uh, of course it's not legally binding but the SDGs have become a de facto international obligation and have reoriented the domestic spending priorities of the member states over the past few years. So whichever, whoever the government is, they have to incorporate these in whatever policy they are making. So let's just take the goal, why, uh, goal wise. Uh, let's take the first goal, no poverty. Goal one aims to end poverty in all its forms everywhere. Ending poverty in all its forms everywhere implies focusing on complete eradication of extreme poverty as well as paying attention to other determinants that influence poverty such as socio-economic, cultural, political and environmental factors. So that is the first goal. Second is zero hunger. Second. So to end all forms of hunger and malnutrition by 2030, making sure all people, especially children, have access to sufficient and nutritious food all year round. So it seeks to end all forms of malnutrition, double agricultural productivity and ensure sustainable food production system. Let's take the third.